Excuse me. You, you in a minute. Oh, hang on. Hang on. What? I just love that. <laughs> <laughs> Today we're playing a game called Alien Gate. Alien Gate. Anything to do with Ridley Scott's Alien? Nope, nothing to do with Gates either. I don't know what the buttons are, but the CDI <laughs> has kind of it has four buttons. Yeah, yeah, I love the I love the only... controller for the CDI. Have you broken off the um No no it unscrews? It unscrews. Oh my god, really? Yeah, yeah yeah. Button number two there okay. is pause. What <laughs> which one? So that one and that one are pause. Oh, because both of them. you see one and one, they, uh, they, okay. they have the same function. Okay. And two and two have the same function. So why's that one got like a dot slash to Because it can also be one in case you need three buttons that do the same thing. Just in case that's what the game requires. Absolutely amazing. Oh shit. In the beginning there were birds. Get off my cable. Not aliens or gates though. <laughs> Alright, so before you explain to me the backstory of this game, I'm gonna go ahead and take a guess. Alright, um... Aliens have come out a gate in space. <laughs> The, the guy that you're playing as is Rayman's older brother. He's got floaty hands. And that up there is the Mask's older brother. Yeah, yeah. Golden Mask. Golden Mask? I found this in a... I don't even know what it was. It, I'd say it was a top 10 worst CDI games list, but it was just basically a list of CDI games. <laughs> I was going to uh, say, it's not much longer, is it? They came on the sides, yep, does that yep. say? Yeah, just be careful that dude shoots the fatty. So is this an educational Christian game? I don't know, there's a big frog in the background. I mean... Yeah, it kind of feels like they were like, okay, what can we add to this background to make it more interesting? Yeah. Without ever stopping to think whether they should have added it. I think that's giving them too much credit. I feel like maybe I could just do this for the sides. <laughs> should I give it a go and see how long I last? <laughs> yeah, mmm... I do like the mild amount of um, like 3D animation that they've decided to do on his movement. Yeah, yeah. If his is the correct pronoun, obviously. It. It's. it's 21st century now, you shouldn't presume these things. Certainly Followed not. by the worms. See, there's something really creepy about this text. It says, like, in the beginning there were the birds. And then it said they came on the sides. And what did that last one said? Follow the worms? You're being followed by worms or something. Like, what the fuck is this thing? How is that okay? It's also not really a worm, is it? Not really. I would wager it's closer to a centipede. I mean, oh. oh! Worm portals! Oh, you're splitting them up into two, mate! You don't want to do that! Oh, shit, yeah, I do. I know what I'm doing. Should I pop a Hulk Hogan? Aim for the target! <laughs> what are you doing, kid? <laughs> you gotta wake up and smell the coffee. We're under attack! A few simple bombs, but don't miss the shield. Oh god. Oh. That all makes sense now. Thanks, bro. That's just the context I needed. This is a piece of shit. <laughs> hey, hey! Oh god, play the game! Okay, we're gonna go central technique. Oh, it's this one. Incredible. <laughs> oh! Oh, the word oh. does it! Fucking idiot. I can't help but feel like this would game would only be improved by a three inch joystick poking out for no reason. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Stop Although, it. again, not much worse than the 64 controller. Actually, it's better than the 64 controller because it's still a D-pad. Because you can use it with only the two sets of hands that, yeah, yeah. that the good lord gave us. <laughs> As opposed to the three or four additional hands that are required to successfully play a 64 game. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Do you know what I like the most about this game is that there's absolutely no like music or attempt at music or ambience of any kind. Or context. Just a head throwing up stuff at you. Yeah, I mean, these, in theory, you could just dodge, couldn't you? In theory, you could turn your ship around and just leave. What's going on here? Yeah, there's not... There's just no attempt at... Context. At anything. 
They was like, okay, so, uh, my cousin Terry, he designed this weird looking gold mask face. And Marjorie from down the down the bread shop, yeah, yeah. <laughs> she designed Rayman's cousin who was actually a plane. <laughs> <laughs> and what we're gonna do is we're gonna have them fight each other for no reason. Yeah, why not, why not, why not? So is that it? They know it's funny because you spent 40 quid on it. I mean, that's the problem, isn't it? But, I mean, is it really any different from going in and buying Assassin's Creed Unity? Wait, have you bought this? this you paid like, for this? This was like a Sunday afternoon to us. <laughs> See, when you think about it nicely, if I had a really unsuccessful comedy show, you could just bring Alien Gate with you. And you saw it, don't you? Incredible. So thank you very much for watching CDI Fridays. Uh, unfortunately, we won't be revisiting Alien Gate. <laughs> nice of the princess to invite us over for a picnic, eh, Luigi? I hope she made lots of spaghetti. Luigi, look!